the Hungarian horn tail. These represent four very real dragons, each of which has been given a golden egg to protect. Your objective is simple. Collect the egg. Hey, what's up guys? It's Sacred here and today I'm super pumped to show you guys this LEGO Harry Potter mock that I'm extremely proud of. And it is the first task from the Trials or Tournament, aka the Hungarian Horntail Arena. And it's actually my favorite task from the Trials or Tournament, which makes this even more awesome for me. And this build just has an insane amount of detail, whether you're looking at the vast amount of figures seated in the audience, or the crazy intricate rock work, or even the super accurate wooden panels. This mock is just is super detailed and accurate. It took me over a week of day-to-day -day building to complete, and I'm just in love with how it turned out. And I also want to mention that this is part of the Trials or Tournament collaboration with the Jackhammer who made the second task and Avaki who made the Graveyard Duel. And both their builds are absolutely insane and some of their best work, so be sure to check it out the links in the description where you'll find their collaboration parts and channel links, and be sure to show them some love. So the actual arena from the movie slash book is in a circular shape, so for the mock, I made sure to use these hinge plates to represent that if you keep adding more sections to this, it would form the full circular minifigure scale arena. And the part I actually built is just a side of the arena since that's what I have the parts for. And it's divided into three sections that are connected with the hinge plates. And the build is supposed to look like one gigantic thing rather than three. So that's why there's some overlaps and that's kind of why I just made sure to have no gaps between the three sections. And I really like how it all flows together and looks like one gigantic thing. So for the bottom half of the mock, it's made up of some extremely intricate rock work. I really went all out with the rock work in this mock. Each of the three rockwork clumps took two days to build, and I utilized so many different techniques for the rockwork, and that's probably why it looks so good. I used all my mixel joints, all my bionicle joints, a ton of clips, a bunch of hinge pieces, some one by one snot bricks that I twisted so I could create some more unique angles, and I also laid down some slopes illegally to create some more different angles. There's just so many unique and crazy angles in the rockwork, even though you only see like five different pieces on the outside, the inner works to achieve the angles are just so complex. If you want to know how to make some really awesome rock work, check out the video on the top right hand corner where I teach you guys. And I mainly used dark gray for the rock work, but I also added some olive green to represent the grass and mosses growing throughout the rocks. I've never used olive green in the past since I've had like five olive green parts, but since I got sick of sand green and I didn't want to use it for this mock, I decided to snip off some olive green parts from Ninjago City and the parts of the Caribbean Silent Mary, and I think it looks a whole lot better with dark gray rock work than sand green does, and I just really like the color, I just wish I had more of it, and I also included the golden egg that Harry is supposed to retrieve in this task. So now, moving on to the old broken down walls that are meant to hold up the seating area, there's just some small sections of the walls towards the top of the rock work, since in the scene the rocks cover up most of the walls, but I used a technique I used for dilapidated walls and I absolutely love how it looks. I used mainly the two gray colors and then some dark tan and some olive green to represent the moss growing throughout the walls and the rocks. And I just think the super tiny detailed parts I used for the walls really make them look old and worn out. And now moving on to the wooden panels above the walls, they look very accurate. I used a dark tan and tan color scheme for them. I also added a little bit of olive green to represent some more moss in the panels. And they're made using plates and tiles. The tiles are sort of in a mismatched array, but the plates are still in a pattern. And overall, I love the effect that they give off. And moving on to the seating area above the wooden panels, they are flooded with a ton of Harry Potter figures. I didn't have enough since I needed close to 50 for this build, so I included some Lord of the Rings slash The Hobbit ones, and also some Pirates of the Caribbean figures, which look somewhat similar to the Harry Potter ones, so I think they flow well together, and that's why my boy Baldi's in the crowd. And the seating area also features these brown divider sort of things, and that's accurate to the movie, and I just think the figures in the audience really complete the build and make it pop more since all the figures' torsos have a bunch of different colors, and 
One of the things you probably noticed right off the thumbnail is the Hungarian Horntail. I slightly modified the one from the LEGO set to make it more accurate, and it's just soaring down to protect the golden egg from Harry, and speaking of Harry, he is on his broom. I used the accurate variant of Harry Potter and connected him to the wooden panels via some transparent studs that I stacked up, and yeah, that's pretty much it for this mock and the video. Thank you all so much for watching, I really appreciate it, it means so much. This was a very tough build and I spent a lot of time on it, but I'm in love with the end result, and be sure to check out Avaki and the Jackhammers collaboration parts down below, along with some more Harry Potter mocks that I've made in the past, such as Hagrid's Hut, and be sure to leave your thoughts and future Harry Potter mock suggestions down below, and subscribe and stay tuned for more, but other than that, take care, and peace out, and never stop creating.